Alrighty everyone, we are back, welcome back to the channel, welcome to the Gaming Moose. My name is Moose, or Mason, if you want to call me by my real name. And we are back to cleaning up after the crackhead named Todd downstairs. Uh, this is where I left off last time because I didn't want to run out of time to do an outro. I apologize for that outro, by the way. I wanted to include my social media and stuff, but then halfway through it remembered that I couldn't remember exactly what my social medias were, so I had to actually look it up in real time. So yeah, apologize for that. Um, we'll be more fluent next time. But uh, yeah, just tidying up his room. We're going to ventilate it because I... whoops. I, uh... whoops. I'm pretty sure that room is pretty stale smelling. Probably smells like fan. Feed ass and nuts. Just kidding. I'm gonna switch this on. God damn it. We want to switch it on. I suck. <laughs> All right. And now to sports. First up, basketball. As the Gears prepare for their critical match with Denver tonight at the Cyberlife Arena in. No one cares. <laughs> Sorry guys, I'm checking out the cartoons. I have always wanted to like see what this was all about. Hmm. Cute. Another 225,000 jobs were lost from the US economy. Love that. Went from fucking cheery to another 220 jobs were lost. Okay. <laughs> Why is it all news anchors talk like this? I feel like this is some sort of requirement, and uh, if talking like this is all you need in order to be a news anchor, then I feel like I qualify to be a news anchor, which is great because I'm currently unemployed and seeking any type of employment. Except for fast food. Sorry, I've got standards. I don't judge anyone who works in fast food, but fast food doesn't work for me. Like. And I don't mean that the way that it sounds, but like, I've got anxiety hella bad. I know lots of people got anxiety nowadays, but it's legit just a thing. Life causes anxiety. But I've got social anxiety on top of actual anxiety. And so, hey, wait a minute, what, are we supposed to tidy something up over here? Um, and so, working in a fast food environment where everyone's like, always frustrated and on the run and doesn't work for me. I don't want you watching cartoons out in the living room because I don't want you playing with stuff out there. Watch cartoons in your bedroom. What? Why can't you find your remote? You had it this morning. Figure it out. Sorry, guys. My kid was literally just watching TV in her room and now she's trying to say that she's got to watch TV in the living room. <sighs> I might actually have to stop recording to make sure that she, uh... Watch it. You know what I forgot, guys? Forgot to read the All Sports. up real quick. Hmm. We're actually going to go in here and clean up the bathroom real quick. Excuse me. <laughs> I'm gross. beautiful self in the mirror. Who are you? Who is you fighting, beach? Just kidding. <laughs> and, oops, yep, let's use. And, you clean. 
clean that floor, girl. You clean it. You get it. You get it so motherfucking clean, I want to be able to eat off of it, girl. Sorry guys, I just paused and stuff, so if the video kind of clipped or whatever. I just want to tidy up your room a little. I had to pause and I go. I only need two minutes. Is that okay, Alice? Help my kid uh, try and find her remote, but she's literally lost it since we handed it to her this morning. Seems you So are she's screwed, and she's going to have to entertain herself without TV because I'm not dealing with it. Alice in Wonderland. Of course. I'm sure we used to be friends before I was reset. Maybe we can be friends again. You should tell me about yourself. What you like to do, where you like to go, your favorite foods. That would really help me. Your father said you chose my name. Kara, it's nice. How did you choose it? You're very quiet. I hope I don't scare you. I've honestly never gotten trusted by this point in the game. It always takes me longer, so that's cool. Sad kid. Android was defending the little girl. Dad hits Android. Android's broken. Little girl sad. sure if maybe I could come back in and grab the gun, you know? What are you doing? Uh, I'm playing. I hate this part. I know what you're thinking. You think your dad's a lowlife? Huh? Fucking loser? 
loser, can't get a job, take care of his family? Don't you think I tried to make things work? But whatever I do, when someone comes along, they just fuck it all up! I know what you think of me. You hate me. You hate me, don't you? Say it! You hate me! What am I doing? I'm sorry, honey. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You know I love you, don't you? You know I love you. saw the gun. We discovered a way down. Hmm. It didn't read putting down a price. Oh well. Go upstairs. I didn't disturb Todd. <laughs> yeah. Read connecting the dots. Didn't do that one. Alright. Moving on. I remembered a timer this time, guys. Except I didn't start it at the beginning of the video, I started it after I came back from helping my daughter, so... There's that. This is my dream house, I'm just saying. My dream house is actually a bit bigger, but... Anything with an entranceway like this... I'd be happy. Ideally, actually, I'd like for the stairs to come down on both sides, or like, be like a wraparound, like, rounded staircase, you know what I mean? Put down. Yeah, I knew it. I was like, I feel like... Do something with the bird. Oh, yeah. Oh, put it back. I know, I hear you. Hang on. Sorry guys, I had to attend to the child. Look, you see it, everything here. Hey, god damn it, stop walking that direction. I'm gonna try it. Gosh, turn the direction that I'm pointing you. Look at these books here. Pretty much that's what we can decide to make ourselves busy as soon as we bring home Skillet down to eat his breakfast. Um, I think I'm going to play the piano this time, because I kind of like, out of all the interactions, because I've done all of them, I like, um, I like playing the piano the best. 
first we're gonna draw the curtains. Oh. Good morning, Carl. Good morning. It's 10 a.m. The weather is partly cloudy, 54 degrees. 80% oh. humidity with a strong possibility of afternoon showers. It sounds like a good day to spend in bed. I did go to pick up the paint that you ordered. Oh, yes, I've forgotten. That is the difference between you and me, right, Marcus? You never forget anything. Show me your arm, please, Carl. No. Carl. Thank you. Hmm. I just opened my eyes and I'm already gritting my teeth. Humans are such a fragile machine. They break down so quickly. All this effort to keep them going. Okay. I'll take you to the bathroom now. Anything special on the agenda today? Yes, there's the opening of your retrospective at the Museum of Modern Art. Mm. The gallery director left four messages asking to confirm your attendance. Hmm. I haven't decided yet. We'll see about that later. Okay. What else? Just your usual fan mail. I've already answered. Hmm. Any news from Leo? No, Carl. I can call him if you like. No. No, I don't bother. I'm starving. Well, your breakfast is ready. Bacon and eggs, just the way you like them. Thank you, Marcus. You're welcome. Television. Why don't you find something to do while I finish my breakfast? Sure. Mm -hmm. Okay, Carl. Or can we just appreciate this guy's store of fucking liquors? I don't drink, but look at this guy. He's like, I am fucking ready. He's even got a half drinking he's even got a got a half drinking glass of whiskey sitting there. Or scotch. You know, whatever it is rich people drink. I don't know. I'm poor. Melancholic, hopeful, interim, intimate, energetic. Let's do energetic. I feel like 
this is how an android would play like a total badass. Something has changed in the way you play. Sometimes I think you have more humanity than most humans. One day I won't be here to take care of you anymore. You'll have to protect yourself and make your choices. Decide who you are and want to become. This world doesn't like those who are different, Marcus. Don't let anyone tell you who you should be. Let's go to the studio. Let's see where we left off. Remove the sheet. I do what I want. No, I'm just kidding. All right. And what's cool is we could actually sit there and watch him finish painting. We don't have to walk around and tidy stuff up, but we are totally going to examine those pictures. Come over here, look at this. Oh, I guess I can inspect, huh? And then we can, come on. There we go. Let's inspect again. Let's clean. Almost done. What's your verdict, Marcus? I'm not programmed to criticize art. I, you would be a much better judge than I would. The truth is, I have nothing left to say anymore. Each day that goes by brings me closer to the end. I'm just an old man clinging to his brushes. Carl. But enough about me. Let's see if you have any talent. Give it a try. Try painting something. Okay, so Paint? we're gonna what finish I... this scene, painting what? and then Anything I'm gonna do want. my outro, guys. Give it a try. <sighs> Aradia, no. Because I know that no matter what we paint, he says the same thing. Which kind of sucks for a game like this, that nothing in this first level really changes. No matter what you do, nothing really changes.
That is a perfect copy of reality. The painting is not about replicating the world. It's about interpreting, improving on it, showing something you see. Carl, I don't think I can do that. It's not in my program. I... Go on, go, try it. Grab that canvas. This crazy motherfucker thinks I can paint and it's not in my programming. Do something for me. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. Trust me. Try to imagine something that doesn't exist, something you've never seen. Now concentrate on how it makes you feel and let your hand drift across the canvas. And let's do humanity. Let's do hope for humanity. We're gonna do hope. Hey, Dad. Leo. I didn't hear you come in. No, I was in the neighborhood. I thought I'd stop by. It's been a while, right? You all right? You don't look so good. Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm fine. <laughs> hey, listen, uh, I need some cash, Dad. Again? What happened to the money I just gave you? Uh, well... It just goes, you know? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you're on it again, aren't you? No. No, no, I swear, it's not that. No, uh, don't lie to me, Leo. What difference does it make? I just need some cash, that's all. Sorry. The answer's no. What? Why? You know why. Yeah, yeah, I think I do know why. <laughs> you'd, rather, you'd rather take care of your uh, plastic toy here than your own son, right? Tell me, Dad, what's, what's he got that I don't? It's smarter, more obedient, not like me, right? But you know what? This thing is not your son. It's a fucking machine! Leo, that's enough. Enough. You don't care about anything except yourself and your goddamn paintings. You've never loved anyone. You never loved me, Dad. You never loved me. I'm sure he did before you became a drug addict and there was no helping you and he had to give up. Only so much you can do for someone who doesn't want to help themselves. Am I right or am I right? Alrighty everyone, thanks so much for watching this part. This was part two. I believe, of the Let's Play uh, Detroit Become Human. Let me know your thoughts, opinions down in the comments section below. Leave me a like if you like this video. Don't forget to subscribe if you're not already subscribed. I'm new and I need all the help I can get. So uh, also share this if you like. And uh, all of that, I will see you guys in the next one. Bye! <laughs>